When you hit a golf ball, there is velocity in the x and y direction. It wants to keep moving in a straight line, but gravity pulls it back down to earth. This is because of Newton's first law. If we draw this motion out, it looks like this. And if we break it up into x and y components, it looks like this. If we draw the free body diagram, we see the only force acting on it is weight. After applying Newton's second law, we learn that only gravity is acting on the ball in the y direction and nothing in the x direction. This is because of constant velocity in the x direction and that means there is no acceleration. This picture shows different launch angles and that 45 degrees will launch it the furthest assuming there's no spin or air resistance. From this, we learn that we need to increase or decrease our launch angle to 45 degrees. If your launch angle is below 45 degrees, you could also increase velocity in the y direction which would give more hang time for the ball to go further. If the angle is above 45 degrees, hitting the ball harder so that the x velocity is larger will make the ball travel further in less time, therefore going further.